hello guys so usually when you want to import um, a file to your studio sometimes you get this error from your um, studio about you know access and so on and so forth depending on the kind of file you want to import especially if it's a text csv file or it's a xlsx file so you can either do this within your studio or you go to your import and export wizard and you still get the same error so what we would do is would have to install the developer edition of sql server so just like in the previous video you go to sql server site to download but this time you're downloading the developer version and when it finishes downloading you run to install so this takes a couple of minutes select basic accept terms and conditions notice that this is much larger than the express edition allow it to install completely and i'll tell you what next to do all right it's finished installing so you can close the installation window go down to your microsoft sql server 2022 and enter your installation center go down to the installation section and select the first option to install a new parameter or a new um, installation type go down according to i've shown you to where you get sql 2022 and select developer and then click on ok then just follow accordingly as i've done here skip next i've gone next until you get to a point where you have to choose which of the servers so remember you want to add something to an existing server which is the developer so make sure what is selected here is your ms sql server select next you can check this select next and select these options analysis server services and integration services basically integration services is what you actually need to click on next and please also make this automatic to automatically come up also make sure you add current user before you proceed from here and then select next and then give it some time to install as well Okay, so once it finishes installation, you can close this window and then go back to your studio or using your import export wizard this time around. So using the import export wizard, we select Excel, select the file that we want to import and then we select the OLE DB SQL Server. Now to select your database name, right? It's usually your PC name. So copy your PC name and paste there. Select Windows Authentication. Select the name of your database that you want to load the file into. And then go on to Next. Choose the file or the sheet in the workbook that you want to load. You can edit the name. You can preview and change the data types or whatever it is you want to do and then click on next and then import so i'll do another video on the steps in importation this is just because of the error now if you go to your connect you can now see that you have two different databases one for express one for express and one for the developer which has our file that we loaded. 